But right here, bro, I remember I had a Toyota camera, bro. My mama backed up to my shit in front of my hood. Love my mama to death, though. So I remember I had to go here and buy a hood. They did a horrible job because my hood came off my car in the middle of the highway and I almost crashed and wrecked. We just left the first Bank of America I ever went to when I was 16 cashing checks. You know what I'm saying? Working little bullshit jobs at Sonic and shit like that. Till now, you know what I'm saying? Now we get the records out of there. We head to my mama's house right now. I'm gonna bless your game. Love my mama to death. So, you know, you gotta take care of your people. What do you want, girl? Apple? How'd you find that apple juice? That's my apple juice. That's my apple juice. You gonna open it? Okay. Give me it. It's hot. It's hot. Feel it. It's hot. It's hot. You feel that? You wanna open? Okay, I'll open it. Look at you cute. Just like your daddy handsome. You beautiful. It's the color. They call the faux faux because the faux faux run through this bus. It's called the faux faux 44. You know what I'm saying? Our bus is called Metro. I have caught the 44 many a times. You know what I'm saying? 44 to 84 to 85, 79. If you're really from the north side, you really know about them bus routes from the northwest to be exact. Not the northeast, 9th and 5th Ward from Eagles Arms. Now we here. Oh, yeah. Slow it down so you can see it over there. Homes. Historical black community in Houston, as you can see. You can see my head cut right off the street right here. This is a barbershop called So Fresh and So Clean. Deep Priest. Right down the street down there. It's always love to be back. It's always good to be back in that It's always humbling to be back. You know what I'm saying? Like, to see where you come from and see how far you came. You know what I'm saying? It always puts your shit in perspective and keeps a nigga humble. You know what I'm saying? Because there's so much work still to be done, you know? Because, you know, I want to do more shit for the hood and just, you know, we do toy drives, we do backpack drives, we do Christmas shit like that too, but I want to take it to another level, you know what I'm saying? I want some property out here really, you know, change niggas' lives, you know what I'm saying? So, it's just a reminder, you know what I'm saying? Of where you come from and, you know, where you got to go, you know what I'm saying? Like, every time you see me throw them phones up, that's what that means. Ain't no Chicago shit. This H town Houston Daddy. shit. Respect the Chicago. Daddy. Yes, baby. Yes, baby. That's my loved one. My my honey bug. My bunny muffin. Bunny muffin. That's your that's your name. You the bunny muffin. The projects down here too. Garden City projects. What's your Garden City apartments? You know what I'm saying. I can take you down there real quick. We'll swing. Agus Home Library. As you can see. Never went there, I don't lie to y'all. Man, my people, when we came out here, we came out here like 90s, late 90s, early 2000s and shit. And this is right when my mama came back from New Jersey and shit. So we were staying off the Soto and Antoine, which is another street over there. Moved around here a couple times, stayed a lot of couple of places around here. And it, even when I was in high school, you know, when I was see out of my people, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know, my people made some of themselves, you know what I'm saying? They not, you know, we not in the hood no more, you know what I'm saying? We in a good part of Acres Homes now. Oaks of Inwood, you know what I'm saying? So we really came out here and elevated. So I got a lot of family out here. I got a lot of niggas who I still got love for, but you know, when you elevate, you gotta elevate in every kind of way. I remember going to this barber college and them fucking my hair up. But we went to the barber college to get our hair cut because it was cheap. Facts. Don't get me wrong, some cold motherfuckers came out of there, but the nigga who cut my hair gave me a chili bowl. And that's when you cut all your shit off at, at the bottom and leave a little at the top. My head big as fuck, so you know that shit like a mushroom. Nobody walking. You see in LA, there's nothing about Houston. We don't do all that walking, it's too hot to walk. This is Garden City right here. I'll take it over here. Garden City Projects. It's where niggas like J Dog from, Living Legend. A lot of real niggas come from over here. Shout out to my nigga Sergio. Real Northside shit. Garden City right there. Shout out to Fast Lane. Shout out to Rizzo. Shout out to everybody from the Northside. See, y'all do this more. And getting into my uncle and I used to stay with my partner over here. I used to walk all the way over to my uncle's house. Stayed right over here. My partner's right over here. Up to no good. For no reason. Fast I'm from the same side of town. A little bit over. But a Houston legend named J Dog, Slim Thug, niggas all from the side of town. Kicking it, it's too hot. You're not gonna see people outside till the sun go down. If I walk from here to here, I'm sweating bullets. This is the good part. Mom came up. Did you break your glasses? Ooh. 
That's a cute baby. Come on. This is because it's your nap time. You break it again? Give me these glasses. They broke. I'll buy you some more today, okay? What's that? What's that? Dog? Yeah. Hmm. Tablet? Smile from mouth. Smile from mouth. Look at the camera. Say cheese. You'll get your modeling on. Give me a hug. I said, give me a hug. I don't want your tablet. <laughs> That's the youngin'. That's me. <laughs> it's my brothers and sisters. Not looking at me. Looking crazy. Look how big that was. I was just stopping at my house in the area. Oh, good. You just came to visit your mama then. Oh, thank you. She's right here. Hey, AJ. <laughs> How you doing? What's that, Daddy? Potato? Potato. I'm painting color. <laughs> grown. Grown? Yes, I'm grown. One day you'll be grown. I don't know. Get in there. Get on in there with that big. Uh, you got your daddy's head. Lean back, Fat Joe. Hold on. You broke the glasses. This is one hand. It's a monocle now. You gotta do what you gotta do for your people. Cameron okay, dropped off two bands. We're gonna get our yard done. You know, do what you gotta do for your mamas and you know, shit. That's just real player shit, grown man shit. And ain't gangsters, it's just doing grown man shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't a gangster, I'm a grown man. This is my grandma's house right here. My Mimi, you just met. She just bought this house. So she owns both these houses. My grandma owns this house and that house. But when we moved here, she moved here in 98. You know what I'm saying? And they try to keep running her away from this motherfucker. My, my, my grandma owned this house and the house next to her. Ball C. Ball C. If that ain't Ball C, I don't know what it is. That's another reason why I go so hard, because it's like, I come from good stock. I come from people who just, they go getters. So I don't know how to not be a go getter. You know what I'm saying? My grandma does all the interior decorating. My grandma's really creative. Incredibly creative. Like, used to walk this whole street. TC Justin from right, from right there, where we left at. To go to my grandma's house after school, all the way from, from Pine Mountain, which is a street way up there. I'm gonna show you Pine Mountain when we go get a chance. But see, we're right back in the world, right back in the Eggers' home. So Oak, Oaks Inwood is kind of like a like a oasis if you want to in the hood if you want to say it's just kind of funny. While my daughter's in the back going crazy coloring. You guys, how? How did you get black? How did you get marketing your face? You're amazing. Why is washable? I be using this. Northeast is like Fifth Ward, Homestead, Fifth Ward. That's like where J Prince and Rapalot, that's where they from. I say Eggers Homes, that's where it's Slim Thug, B, you know, Fast Lane, J Dog, you know, legends like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm the first thing to go platinum with Eggers Homes since Slim Thug out my city. First thing to go platinum out my city in a long time, period. Until, you know, since May, you know, before May, really, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, really a legend out here, bro. Cause I really got it out the mud around here. Corner of Antoine and um, TC, uh, Antoine and Victory. It's a signing over there. It's gone now. It's like a wash interior or some shit now. But that was my first ever fucking job. I remember telling the manager back then, they fired me and shit. Nigga time out. I told him, like, nigga, this is Sonic. You gonna still be here flipping burgers. I'm gonna be a platinum producer one day. I had it, I knew what I wanted to do back then. You know what I'm saying? So we stayed there. We stayed over here too. Pop the Soto. It's a really hectic block, I ain't gonna lie to you. So don't hit this motherfucker. But I stayed down here too. Harlem Clark, Sunnyside. You know, we didn't go past the Galleria. So we didn't go past the mall. So when I went to high school, you know, let's go to a good high school like Lamar, when everybody was just busted in from all different sides of the town. And I'm really grateful for that because it opened my, my mind. By the way, go China Dog got the best Chinese food in the world. I don't care what nobody say. I love China Dog. That's my shit. Rawson's, that's like our liquor store out here that we known for. But it's in every hood. More projects. Timmy Chan's, Chinese food, hood Chinese food, you know. More projects, more hood shit. House of Fries. We got some fat shit for your ass. Another barber school. Mama yeah. Soul Food is so fucking fire. Remember I told you I walked from that one street to what street? So this is the street I walked from. This is Palmont right here. So I walk from Palmont all the way to my grandma's house. It's like four, three, four miles. All this was my stopping ground. So that's Whataburger, H Town shit. Gotta get hip to that. I got in trouble in high school, or in school period. My mama got my whole head shaved off. It's a punishment. Like, got my whole my hair cut off. And it was at this barbershop right here. Jalen's. And the crazy thing about Jalen's barbershop, bro, 
Dylan's Barbershop been around since I was a kid, bro. I used to go to that shit when I was eight years old, when I was younger than my son. You know what I'm saying? So, to see it still there, it's wild. Now we in Oak Forest, now we out of Acres on. This is Oak Forest, it's totally different. Look downstairs and see this nigga Frank. Hey, me and Age been fucking with him since we was kids. Getting drew from him. When it was faking everything, we ain't know no, no, no better, but now we get the real shit. But we still have to clean our jewelry and shit. My brother. Hey, where's your boy It's so ironic because it's kind of like how that house is kind of like how I did the house with Randall and everything. Y'all just have you. I just come over and make beats and shit. Right. Hey. 